We ran a reverse against Colorado. They're running a reverse handoff to Love. And from the sidelines, it seemed like everyone was standing still. And Love cuts back. Look at Love's speed. God. It was almost like a mirage. Bryce Love sprinted through the Colorado defense. And that's when we realized this guy's speed is real. It's different. We both came back for our senior year. Mm. This is the major difference. I came back and I took one class. <laughs> Ballroom dancing. Uh, <laughs> You're a little different. Take me through just a typical day during the fall from school to football. What's that look like for you? What I would do is in the morning, I'd probably wake up around like 7 or 8, go from breakfast to treatment. Class would be at 10.30. And get out of class, go back to class at like. Uh, My mind's already well, circling. Know, go, through all this stuff. <laughs> go to meetings, meetings to practice. Then after that, go eat dinner, do study whatever, then go to sleep. So. And then you just do it all over again. Yeah, the every next day, day it's tough. It's wow. tough. On the field, he's electrifying, but off the field, I mean, he wants to be a doctor. How do you compare, kind of, the Bryce Love on and off the football field? I tell the guys all the time about the ideal, you know, Stanford man mm -hmm. and guys like John Lynch uh, right. are in that category for me. We're off the field, they're the guy that you want your daughter to marry, and on the field, they're that assassin. So the two, the fact that they can exist in one guy <laughs> is awesome. You can't love a bad name. This is Love. He's a home run hitter, and he may have just hit one here. I always say that, um, you know, football is obviously a chaotic game, right. but I mean, to me, it's just like uh, peaceful in mm -hmm. a way. Um, just that calmness of just kind of moving around and, you know, just breaking tackles or whatever else. You know, it's just going and getting what's out there. I played with Reggie Bush at USC, who was electrifying. With Bryce, I think it's a little bit of the same. What kind of luxury is that for you? So the exciting thing for me is that he's not one of those players that it's, he's dependent on the play. Right. With Bryce, it doesn't matter. It just matters if he touches the ball. At some point, <laughs> one of them's going the distance. The question, and everyone's talking about, is the Heisman Trophy, mm -hmm. right? How important would it be for you to win that trophy and bring it back to here? Uh, yeah, I mean, it would be, you know, an honor, you know, for sure to be able to represent uh, the university in that way. Beyond anything else, you know, I just kind of have that mindset of just, you know, being the best teammate that I can be. You know, I'd rather have just an, an amazing team and an amazing unit and accomplish amazing things.